Hello everybody and welcome back to Gotham Lounge. My name is Joe, and today we're back to some more Horizon Forbidden West. Alright, we need to find a cannon. We're gonna blast this dang wall down. Melee hit the bulwark. Holy moly, we got a lot of stuff here. Gather some of these real quick. That. Okay, uh, find a can. I'm gonna go up this way. We're getting close to where we saw the rebels before. So, is this where we can get a cannon? Like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Ready? Move out! What in the world is that? That's like a robotic holy mammoth. My God! You wanted your cannon, and that thing has them. This won't be easy to take down, especially with this. I'll handle the big guy. You focus on the others. I'll follow you in. Oh my God! Maybe I should. Rebel Tremitas. Fun. What did it say it was weak against? My focus can help. Load up, squad. Frost. Well, let's focus on the little things. They're down. Crap, I shouldn't have grabbed that. Oh, and there's a question mark. Is somebody coming over here? Holy crap. You know, don't think there's even any logical way. Yeah. Holy. The only way I'm going to be able to get to it is if I, uh... I mean, he's not going to move from that spot, and obviously, Silent Strike isn't going to do squat to it. I think the only way I'm going to take this thing out is if I find a weak spot and just strike it first. Like, for example... That was actually a weak spot. Uh, oh god. Oh my god. I'm actually just so very surprised at the damage I'm already doing so far to it. Ah. Look out, look out. Woof, woof. Oh, God. No. There's no safe way to approach this thing at all. Just trying to get the underbelly of this thing.
Oh my god. Well, maybe I should see if there's anything I can use to take that thing down. Maybe not a lot to use to take it down. I'm gonna silent strike this dude. I'm worried if poison might be the better way. Ow! Look out! Way too close! Way too close! Oh my god, I'm getting absolutely trampled by this thing. Nope, poison doesn't do squat. Look out. Oh my god. Get out of there, get out of there. I'm in serious trouble, guys. ran in my own trap. There we go. Full potion. Where did it go? That did a lot of damage. Me right from the top of that rock. Alright, I gotta rummage around. I didn't use that. Where did it go? Over there. there it is.
Got one over here. Health. Crap, that's not gonna do squat. I got some health, not a lot. I really need a potion. Not a potion. A potion would be awesome. But I need... Get up, get up. I gotta use it, I gotta use it. Come on, get up. I gotta use it. I gotta use it. There. Much better. I have no help at all. Now I do. How long? Way the hell up there. This thing just so, takes so much. Oh. there anything around I'm in desperate need of health right now that helps a lot that just gave me a crap ton of health I'm gonna top off just in case Try and see what made it. Here we go. Revive. Okay, you're back in. Don't want to take this thing head on, even though he, we're doing pretty good as far as damage. That did a ton of damage. Holy. Going for the underbelly. Did I just take it out? Oh, there's still enemies nearby. You. How awful would that be? I take out a boot. One cut at a time. Don't think about it, Joe. Don't think about it. Yeah. I think that's everybody. 
Oh my god. I was going to say, how awful would that be if I literally took the thing down and then I die stupidly from one of these rebel soldiers that are around and about? Alright, let's just go around and take everything in sight. There were some more medicinal plants. Can't grab that, it's stuck in the tree. That's a trap, do not blast into that. Really? There was a cannon behind the rock the whole time and I didn't even see it? Oh man, I would have. That would have been almost game over if I just, if I knew it was there, I would have blasted that thing away. Oh well. Okay, uh, we have to loot the thing. Look at all that. This is coming back with us. I'm not looking forward to hauling this all the way to the bulwark. Hmm. Here. I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. Something's got to make up for your lack of an arm. After you. After me? Man, I am sweating my butt off. <laughs> that was quite a bout we just had. Thing will do the job. Has to. Let's start gathering some stuff here. Winter Paleberry. Probably use this to craft or cook stuff. Well, guys, I forgot to mention, um, Prior to the last episode, I did upgrade my armor, as well as some of the weapons that I have. And I'm so grateful that I did that. Because otherwise, I would have been completely screwed. <laughs> this is where we're going? There it is. Okay. Here it is. But you don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. You know who you're talking to, right? Okay. Gotta blast away some rocks so I can expose the power cell. It's working! It'll work. Well, isn't it has to work. Two children playing siege. I hope you call them children. Come now, stop embarrassing yourselves and leave this poor mountain alone. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still answer Hikaru's call. This is your last chance. You have it backwards. Leave this place, Savage, now and take this cripple with you. All right, suit yourself. Down it goes. We gave you a ch we gave you numerous chances to listen to us. And if this isn't proof that this wall's not gonna save you, I don't know what will. This was just one cannon. And Regal's got an army of machines just as powerful. What have you done? Can't hide behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaro. Never. 
Never. We will... We will rebuild it. Immediately. You are not safe. The bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon. Let alone an army of machines. That's what I just said. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. You decreed that no challenges would be sent, while the clan remained safe behind the bulwark. So send them now. Unless your word means nothing. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. Nicely done, Marshal. What's gonna happen to this place? They'll have to live without their wall. But that's better than living apart from the tribe, as pawns in Dakota's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera, the chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah, maybe I will. I'll take my leave then. I need to report to Hikaru. I'll see you at the culvert. Good. You did well, sir. We may need another miracle there as well. I got a pocket full of them. Lead the main quest, the Broken Maybe Sky. There. See if everyone's all right. There we go. We'll Look at all those skill points I just got and XP. Might also be a good idea to I just, before you I have new main quest, the Culver. Nice. Hold on. I'm gonna go back here for a second. It looks like right up here. I actually take the lift back up. There's a lot of missions over here. I'm gonna unlock these. Get them on the map. Hey guys, I just blasted down your wall. Don't mind me just coming through here. Uh, we gotta go up there. Let's have a chat with this person. Right here. You and I should speak. Are you Chaplain Jera? Catalo said I should talk to you to see if you need help. Bold move, Wallbreaker. Burying Takote's pride beneath the bulwark's rubble. I was just. We're gonna point. At ease. Many in the clan agree with you, and Marshal Cotello was right to send you to me. There is something you can help with. A few of our soldiers followed him to the embassy at Baron Light, against Takote's orders. Right. I remember Catalo showed up last, with only a few representatives from the Sky Clan. When those soldiers returned home, Takote reassigned them to an old watchtower. One we had abandoned to the machines. He insisted that with war brewing it must be reclaimed, but those soldiers are serving no one out there. If, however, they were to return by request of Hakaro's champion, Takote wouldn't have the backing to deny them, especially when their chaplain supports their return. Tell a few soldiers to come home and give Takote another black eye? Sounds easy enough. Go to the cold rushes, a long stretch to the west. The watchtower stands beside the falls. Speak to Kiva there, the squad's leader. Good luck. Thank you. New errand, call and response. All right, we got a couple more quests to unlock. We got one. Oh, hold on. This is something else. Oh, there's little kids running around. We'll take those. Uh, I don't know. Oh, cook. Let's see. Local stew. Do I have stuff? I don't believe I do. At least not here, I don't. 
Ouch. Well, you know what? I may as well max out on that. There we go. Let's have a trade. Thank you. Where's everybody else? Oh, he's up here. Okay. And there's a stash right over here, too. That. What's going Jekka. on? Jekka. The wall breaker. The wall. Jekka's that's. I'm gonna be forever known as busting the, the wall down. He'll finish the climb. I know it. <laughs> Not likely. My brother Pento left to climb the March of the Ten to get his soldier's mark. They were supposed to be done by now, but he's not back yet. Jekka, Lataka, to your training now. Your brother should have stuck to his cleaning duties. Would you mind checking up on the march? If I leave, my squad leader will kick my ass. And I don't want anyone thinking I'm worried about my brother making the climb. Because I'm not. I get it. You can't miss the path markers. They're by the waterfall west of here. If I head that way, I'll see what's going on. Thank you. No slacking, soldier. New side quest: a soldier's I'm coming, march. I'm coming. Now we got one more. Up this way. Now looks like we have ooh, Stitcher outfits. Sareva. Can I ask what you're arguing about? Oh, Sareva won't let it rest. She insists our comrade Farika flew on the wings of the Ten. But I say, hanging on to a Stormbird for dear life isn't the same. A Tanakh throw to Stormbird? She went up in the air. But road is a strong word. Ha! Huh, you admit it. You're talking about her like she's no longer around. She's not. After she grabbed onto the machine, it flew off with her to that mountain top. The Stormbird still circles the peak. But we never saw Farika again. That's sad. What a way to go. I'll say. A shame no one can reach that mountain top. She was a great soldier with armor to match, and it serves no one lying up there. I'm a pretty good climber. No doubt. But unless you want to try what Farika did, there's no realistic way to get up there. For now. Yeah. I'm telling you, she flew. New Aaron, first to fly. Alrighty, guys. Well, it looks like we unlocked several new side missions. We got a couple new errands as well. First to fly, that's actually on hold. Hold until the Wings of Ten has been complete. Oh, interesting. Never had that. I mean, I've had that in other games where missions were on hold, but yeah, this is, uh, that's interesting. And we got a melee pet, which we did find. Oh, interesting. That's level one. But what we've got right now is the coal route right here. With the Sky Clans challenges on their way, coal route is ready to begin. To claim Aether, Aloy must ensure the competition succeeds. And again, a butt ton of XP. Alrighty, guys. So, when we come back, we will head back to the coal route and uh, figure out the next steps. And it looks like we're just an inch closer to getting eight there, and uh, hopefully that'll be very, very soon. But until then, guys, I'm going to actually go ahead and end the episode right here. So, thank you guys very much for tuning in today for this episode of Horizon Forbidden West here in Gotham Lounge. If you guys enjoyed the video, please go ahead and leave a thumbs up on the video, and feel free to leave a comment down below, as always. If you'd like to continue to stay in touch with us, watching future videos, or videos of our past, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button on the lower right hand corner of the screen, and you'll get a bell notification every time I upload a brand new video. So once again guys, thank you very much for tuning in today for this episode of Horizon Forbidden West here in Gotham Lounge, and you guys have a fantastic day!